Previously, we have discussed about the hardware architecture of an embedded system. Now let's get to know the software architecture of an embedded system. The software layers consists of, there are four layers such as application layer, system service layer, operating system, then hardware abstraction layer above the hardware. So these three layers in between actually bring in interaction between the application software uh, utilized by the user with the hardware components. Coming to the different layers here, the hardware abstraction layer consists of a bootloader, board support package and device drivers. The bootloader does initialization and loads the operating system into the hardware. Whereas the board support package enables the operating system to run on the hardware. Coming to the device drivers, it is the software with which the computer system or the embedded system could be interfaced with the external input output devices. Then coming to the operating system, they are actually the managing software to manage the hardware resources. Coming to the file system, file system is a software which enable to organize the information or store the information. Coming to the GUI graphical user interface will give the interaction to the user in the form of visuals about its color, size, uh, its form, etc. Coming to the task management, task management will enable uh, the hardware to operate upon different programs written for uh, different applications. Likewise, task management will happen. Then coming to the application, it is the software utilized by the user to carry out his applications. So these are the different layers in the architecture of the software of an embedded system.